What is up YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be talking about YouTube scammers and how I handled them. I'm also going to be ranting on them a little bit. So for those of you who don't know, I'm going to be talking about YouTube scammers like Zymer Tracks, Todd, Trap Town, Trap Town LSD, uh, Fortley, Weston Vaughn or whatever. Just a bunch of annoying people who will go to your videos and comment things like, hey, fantastic video, let's be YouTube friends. The reason they comment these things is they automatically think that due to the fact they have a lot more subscribers than you, you're going to be like, wow, my first comment on my YouTube channel. You're going to click and be like, holy shit, this guy has a bunch of subscribers, I'm going to subscribe to him. When in reality, a lot of us aren't that stupid, but a lot of us are very much so misguided on this issue where they don't know. And it's kind of pathetic from them knowing that there's a very good chance they have over thousands of subscribers, yet they're still bothering people about this. And eventually, YouTube is going to bring them down. Although, they say a lot that we will win, we will remain, nothing's going to take us down. That's obvious bullshit, because spam goes against the community guidelines here on YouTube. So obviously, you're gonna fucking go down. Now, I'm gonna talk about how I deal with them before I actually get into the rant. Uh, when I see a comment like this, I immediately jump on it. For example, I will go to my YouTube studio and I will look for the comment. I will click on the channel and I will copy the channel link. Then I will go back to the YouTube studio and I will report that comment for spam. And I will block that user or hide them from my channel. Now, the reason I copy their channel is because I go back and I look to see if they have any other channels connected to them. Like on the side where it showcases the channels that are your friends and this and that, they, spammers normally have about three on those little sidebars there. So you're gonna wanna click on those and look for the main source. Like for example, the person that did it to me yesterday was no copyright music or something like that. So I looked into it, and eventually it led down to Zymer Tracks, which is a very notorious YouTube spammer, a very popular one, and in my opinion, one of the most annoying fucking idiots on the internet who can go jump off a cliff for all I fucking care. He's very annoying. So what I'll do is I will copy that channel link, and I will go back to my YouTube studio, I will go to my settings, and I will look to where... It says there's the approved users and the blocked users. And I will copy the link into the blocked users, press enter, and I will click on the channel and save. Now, that does stop some spam comments from that channel for a long time for me. Like, for example, when I first did it to Todd about a few months ago, I haven't had any comments from Todd since. And I'm very thankful. But there is a lot of spammers coming up and raining their parade over everybody, if you know what I mean. I'm not exactly the greatest when it comes to speech, because I fucking suck. But it's alright. Um, that's how I take care of them. I just block them from my channel. I do not subscribe to them. Because I've seen a video talking about how if you subscribe to them, they can get access to your channel. We don't want that. Because I'm assuming some of these channels actually used to be real people. Like, Zymertrax could have been a real person. Um, I know there was another one, I don't remember, but it started with a C, and on a channel called What Shall We Do Next, uh, he showcased that it wasn't a YouTube spammer, it was a dude who had his channel hacked, and he didn't want any problems, he was on What Shall We Do Next side. So I feel like the majority of these YouTube channels who are hacked, or spammers, except for Todd, were actually people at one time. But that's just my assumption. I don't know 100% for sure. Um, but it's needless to say they are annoying when they spam your comments. Uh, and some people may not know how to react. Some people may be like, oh, this is awesome. This is so awesome. It's not awesome. They're going to try to ruin your time here on YouTube. And it's happened to quite a few people already. Not only that... A Geometry Dash YouTuber named Dansman was hacked not too long ago. I don't think that has anything to do with these spammers, but I think it could be a possibility. I'm not sure. But yeah, I just wanted to make a small video talking about this. Um, I hate them. 
<laughs> I hate all the spammers. They're really annoying. And I hope they die out. And I feel like the main reason they're here is because of the COVID-19 pandemic. That YouTube isn't like in the studio and this and that. A lot of them are coming out to play. So hopefully YouTube gets on their ass and, or gets off their ass and takes care of these stupid fucking spammers. They're really annoying. And I'm not stupid enough to fall for their trick, for their tricks or shit. But I'm sure someone else doesn't have any knowledge on them and they're going to fall for it. And no, I'm not calling them stupid. I'm saying that they're lacking any information on these guys. Meaning they could just look at it as a really big YouTuber and they're like, holy shit. I'm going to subscribe to you because you have a shit ton of subscribers. So if you're watching this and you got a comment like that, do not give in to it. Honestly, don't do it. It's not worth it. Just ignore them. Move on. Do your own thing. And do what I said. Just put them in your block list. Hide them from their channel or your channel. And report their comments for spam. Now, I'm sorry for my speech in this video. I just woke up not too long ago, and normally in the mornings, I can never fucking talk. You know why? Because I'm retarded. But yeah, this was James. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. It'll help me out, and I would appreciate it. And I will see you all in the next video.